Welcome viewers to the SD online classes. Today in our third video uh, of class 9 physics in this chapter gravitation and flotation uh, we have already finished law of universal law of gravitation or Newton's law of gravitation. After that we did uh, what is the third, third law and uh, gravitation and then we did acceleration due to gravity g and now today we are doing factors affecting acceleration due to gravity. How many things can affect the acceleration due to gravity? First number one is altitude. Altitude is also called height. Okay, How the height is affecting it? It is easy to understand. If you remember g formula is g m by r square. right? If you understand this formula clearly, you will easily understand how the altitude will affect. Suppose this is the earth and this is where we are measuring the acceleration due to gravity. So, altitude means this is the mass of the earth, this is the radius of the earth. Suppose you go little far, suppose you go here, okay, if you reach here and you try to measure how much is g here. Here I found it is g, okay, fine. But when you reach here, what will happen? This radius will increase. Can you see? The distance will increase. So that means this is going to increase. What will happen? g will become here. If I measure g here, another g will be here, okay, here g will be g m r can you see r plus some height isn't it r will increase so this r plus h square now if anything in increases in the denominator very important okay anything increases in the denominator denominator the bot the down one then this will change okay if i in if this is 6.4 into 10 to power uh, 6 meter if then if it is more then what will happen this will become less so as the height or altitude increases increases g decreases remember okay acceleration due to gravity at the surface of the earth is 9.8 meter per second square but if you go away from the earth above okay at some height and try to measure it it will be very uh, it is it will go going on decreasing and decreasing okay that is the case first thing I understood now second thing it was also changes with the depth depth factors affecting acceleration due to gravity altitude now depth depth means suppose you have this earth okay and you are standing here your g is 9.8 meter per second square fine but suppose this is the earth radius r this is m if you go inside the earth suppose you reach here and try to measure it what will happen from here if you see the mass will be very less the sur the the effective radius understand very important the effective radius the point where you want to measure the acceleration due to gravity here if you want to measure g here the mass will be only this much very less mass okay not this outside mass will not be considered so mass is reduced so what will happen g g m by r square g dash at some height this what will happen g that m will decrease m will decrease m will be small now because this m will be only considering only up to this much then radius also will be less but it will not affect much okay r minus d maybe r minus d r square but mass change is very big okay so as the depth increases if you go deeper g decreases both same way it will change okay even if you go away from the earth also acceleration due to gravity decrease even if you go inside the earth dig a hole and go inside also acceleration due to gravity will decrease the third one what is the third one third one is shape of the earth shape of the earth this will also affect the acceleration due to gravity how it is going to affect let us see suppose this is your earth radius is r mass is m but in real you know that earth is not a sphere it is something like this 
right it is something like this so that means what this side and this side this equator equator side has longer radius but poles pole these are pole 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 equator 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 is longer so this radius is more here so then what will happen g equal to look at here here if you measure the acceleration to gravity the radius is less radius is less g will be more when you measure here radius is more radius is more so this will be less so acceleration due to gravity at pole will be more okay then acceleration to gravity at equator understand why because of the radius more here radius radius more here acceleration due to gravity will be less radius less acceleration due to gravity will be more so this is the case of the third one okay this is the one you need to remember with the reason why it is happening okay this is all you have learned in the factors affecting the uh, acceleration due to gravity altitude height depth inside and shape of the earth